Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Whatever time it is for you in your geographical location, you are welcome to the short word for today's audio daily devotion. We are getting ready to read God's word, the short word for today's audio daily devotion by Jefferson Otombara Ingbi. You can visit our website for more resources. If you want to send in your prayer request, feel free as you take the time to fill out the prayer request form on our home page at www.theshoreword.org.uk The foundation of the sure word for today is Luke chapter 4, verses 18 and 19. The Spirit of the Lord is upon me because He had anointed me to preach the gospel to the poor. He had sent me to heal the brokenhearted, to preach deliverance to the captives, and recovering of sight to the blind to set at liberty them that are bruised, to preach the acceptable year of the Lord. The sure word for today is the abundance of the free favor of the Lord. This week's title for the sure word for today's series is When You Are Stuck, Part 3 of 7. The affirmation for this week's sure word for today, God will do a new thing for me. All Bible quotations are from the King James Version, unless otherwise stated. This week's Bible verse is from the book of Isaiah chapter 43, verses 18 and 19. Here is the Bible verse quote. Remember ye not the former things, neither consider the things of old. Behold, I will do a new thing. Now it shall spring forth. Shall ye not know it? I will even make a way in the wilderness and rivers in the desert." Unquote. There are thousand and one reasons why you will feel being stuck. There comes a day when you realize turning the page is the best feeling in the world because you realize there is so much more to the book than the page you were stuck on. You don't always need a plan. Sometimes. You just need to breathe, trust, let go and see what happens. Nothing is impossible. The word itself says, I'm possible. It is hard to fail, but it is worse never to have tried to succeed. Anything is possible. You can be told that you have a 90% chance or a 50% chance or a 1% chance chance but you must believe and you must fight you are always one decision away from a totally different life make that one decision never to get stuck keep moving join me as i read the short word for today's audio devotion there are valuable links below this video or you can visit our home page at www theshoreword.org.uk You can also subscribe to the Sure Word Devotion and it will be delivered to your email address every day. Please, don't forget to subscribe to this channel on YouTube and click the bell icon for notifications. The reasons you begin to have the feelings of being stuck in life is endless, one of which is hopelessness. When you start to feel like there is no hope of any change, that nasty feeling of being stuck will be activated in your life. It is not a good place. It is filled with too much negative energy. This negative energy has the power to destroy other parts of your life. So, you must be cautious of not allowing the feeling to dominate your mind. Feeling stuck starts with your thoughts. If you think you're stuck, then I must admit that you're stuck. It's as simple and as complicated as that. As you think in your mind, so you are. Your situations are created by your thoughts. Your thoughts frame how you see the world. Your thoughts are the foundation of your current paradigm. It is easy to use your thoughts to create a convenient narrative about why you cannot do things or progress in life. 
You are the only one who can limit your greatness. And one sure way you limit your greatness is by having that negative feeling of being stuck, playing the victim mentality. The part of negative thinking is a slippery slope. It will keep you in a place you perceive safety. Nothing can limit you in life. The only limit is the one you set yourself. Don't limit yourself. Many people limit themselves to what they think they can do. You can go as far as your mind lets you. What you believe, remember, you can achieve. Why limit yourself to what your eyes see when you have an opportunity to extend your vision? If you limit your choices only to what seems possible or reasonable, you disconnect yourself from what you truly want and all that is left is a compromise. Stop being afraid of what could go wrong and start getting excited about what could go right. You can't put a limit on anything. The more you dream, the further you get. We have reached the end of part 3 of the Sure Word Audio Devotion series titled When You're Stuck. Please join me as I read and affirm the Sure Word capsule. We are getting ready to read God's words. The Sure Word Capsule by Jefferson Otombara Ingbi. I would like you to read this at least once, twice or three times a day. Whatever you are going through, this word will help you. If you start with me and repeat every word that I read, you will be blessed. Do not leave gaps in this recording. I will join you to repeat the Sure Word Capsule. This is the day the Lord has made. This is the day the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. I will rejoice and be glad in it. I am my superhero. I am my superhero. I refuse to give up. I refuse to give up because I have not tried all possible ways. Because I have not tried all possible ways. I am adventurous. I am adventurous. I overcome fear by following my dreams. I overcome fear by following my dreams. I will not compare myself to strangers on the internet. I will not compare myself to strangers on the internet. I will not compare myself to anyone. I will not compare myself to anyone. I am a loving person. I am a loving person. I am purposeful. I am purposeful. I am created with divine intention. I am created with divine intention. I feed my spirit. I feed my spirit. I train my body. I train my body. I focus my mind. I focus my mind. It is my time to excel. It is my time to excel. I am in charge of how I feel. I am in charge of how I feel. And today, I am choosing happiness. And today, I am choosing happiness. I have the power to create change. I have the power to create change. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. I deserve the best. I deserve the best and I accept the best now. And I accept the best now. I get things done fast. I get things done fast. I never put things off. I never put things off. I am a doer. I am a doer. I act quickly. I act quickly. I am motivated to finish my tax. I am motivated to finish my tax. I have the willpower to do my assignments. I have the willpower to do my assignments. I am a proactive person. I am a proactive person. I am fully committed to achieving my goals. I am fully committed to achieving my goals. I cast unto God, I cast unto God, every anxiety and depression, every anxiety and depression. I am feeling right now, I am feeling right now. And the Lord has embraced, and the Lord has embraced, extinguished, extinguished and crushed the anxiety and depression, and crushed the anxiety and depression. I am like a tree planted, I am like a tree planted by the rivers of water, by the rivers of water. I bring forth fruit, I bring forth fruit in my season, in my season. 
My leaf shall not wither. My leaf shall not wither. And whatsoever I do will prosper. And whatsoever I do will prosper. The grace of God, the grace of God makes my mistakes prosper. Makes my mistakes prosper. I walk in the light of the word of God. I walk in the light of the word of God and live by the word of faith and live by the word of faith. I declare that today, I declare that today, this city and country I live in, this city and country I live in, we yield its fruit for me, we yield its fruit for me, and I shall eat my fill, and I shall eat my fill, and dwell in this city and country in safety, and dwell in this city and country in safety. I am not sick, I am not sick. My Lord has healed me of all kinds of disease. My Lord has healed me from all kinds of disease. God has not given me a spirit of fear. God has not given me a spirit of fear, but of power, love, and a sound mind. But of power, love, and a sound mind. I overcome every fear with the blood of Jesus. I overcome every fear with the blood of Jesus. I decree and declare that I have a sound mind. I decree and declare that I have a sound mind. By faith, by faith, we believe that those things we pray, we believe that those things we pray, we receive, we receive, and we have them, and we have them in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. We have reached the end of the Sure Word Audio Devotion and the Declaration of the Sure Word Capsule. Please visit www.thesureword.org.uk for more capsules tailored to meet your specific needs. You can also put a request for a capsule to be created for any challenge you are having. Thank you for listening and confessing along. Please, don't forget to share this audio devotion. I would also love it if you can subscribe and click the bell icon so you can get the notification anytime we post a new audio devotion. Have a gorgeous day and may God continue to bless you, enlarge your course and increase your substance. Amen.